Hey everyone, in this video we're going to talk about the telephone color code. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to open up this 4 pair cable and this 25 pair cable and show you all the pretty colored wires inside and explain to you why they're all those different colors and what they mean. So this is a pretty typical network cable. It's a category 6 cable. It's got 4 pair in it. So notice I'm using the word pair and not wire. That's because each one of these is actually two wires. So there's a total of eight wires inside a network cable. They are grouped by pairs. So I've got a blue pair, an orange pair, a green pair, and a brown pair. And they go in that order. First pair, second pair, third pair, fourth pair. So the wires are grouped by pairs because it does two things. One is it reduces noise. So by having those wires so tightly twisted together, that creates a noise canceling effect which prevents noise, information, electromagnetic force, or even the voice conversations from bleeding from one set of wires into the other set of wires. And of course in the case of data, we want things to be as less noisy as possible to keep the data speeds up, otherwise we do a lot of error correction. Um, the second thing is that it gives them uh, individual uh, functions. So for instance, in your network cable, in the 100 megabit networks and the 10 megabit networks, which I know are old now, but it used to be that it was the orange and the green that did the communicating. So orange was transmit and green was receive or vice versa. And basically the blue and the brown were just along for the ride. Now today in gigabit networks, we actually use all four pair. Okay, now let's take a look at the 25 pair. This cable has 50 wires inside of it. So let's cut it open and see what's inside. And the reason the 25 pair is important is because it is essentially the basis of the entire color code. Once we get to the end of counting the 20, 25 pair or the 50 wires, essentially it just starts all over again. So inside this is a bunch of different wires grouped by major colors. White, red, black, yellow, and violet. Violet is a color, it's a purple color, but don't call it purple or you'll get ridiculed in the field. It's referred to as violet. Also there's a gray and gray is referred to as slate. All right. All right, let me get these all grouped out and I'll explain them. Okay, so I got those all grouped out. Made you kind of an ugly looking little flower here to demonstrate. Now you would normally never have to do this, but I did this so that you could understand my point here. Do you see how I've got these five different groups? I've got a white group, I've got a red group, a black group, a yellow group, and a violet group. So this is the first group, second group, third group, fourth group, fifth group. So the way it works is, is within the first group you've got a blue, an orange, a green, and a brown. Just like we had in that four pair network cable. Except with, with the 25 pair there's one more pair in a group and that is slate. It looks gray but please call it slate. So in the white group I've got blue, orange, green, brown, slate. In the red group I've got blue, orange, green, brown, slate. In the black group, blue, orange, green, brown, slate. And yellow, same thing, blue, orange, green, brown, slate. And then lastly, in the violet group, blue, orange, green, brown, slate. So these are your pairs one through 25. The first five, and then five through 10, 11 through 15, 16 through 20, and then 21 through 25. Now you might be thinking to yourself, okay, so what happens when you have a 50 pair, or a 100 pair, or a 600 pair? So what they do is if you say, for instance, have a 100 pair cable, they'll put four sets of 25 pair in there, and then what they'll do is on the ent entire 25 pair, so imagine this, if this was stripped and you could see this all bare wire, they would wrap a colored ribbon around it. Uh, like almost like dental floss. It's, it's, uh, it's, it's, a, it's a color ribbon and it's going to be in the same color pattern. So the first 25 pair would be wrapped in a blue-white ribbon and then the second 25 pair would be wrapped in an orange-white ribbon and so on and so on. Okay, so once you know the first 25 pair, you basically got it. After that, it's just a matter of just repeating the process over and over and over. Hope that helps you out with your telecom knowledge. Thanks so much for watching.